Hey everyone, we're back. We're on day 89, Beyond the Waters, 100 Days of Devotion. And today we're going to talk about releasing what's on the inside of you. So release what's inside. It is time to take a look past ourselves today. If you sense the times we're living in, you would not be afraid nor fearful. I just want to talk about that because I hear this come out of Christians' mouths all the time. And I'm like, ah, oh, you don't get to choose when you're going to be born. You know, it's kind of set by the Lord and he chooses what generation you're going to be born in. And so stop wishing you were born in another generation or I wish I was born back then when Jesus walked the earth or you were picked and chosen to be born in today's time. And yes, is the world, you know, crazier? Are things just seem in chaos? That's why you're here. This should be exciting for you because if you were handpicked and selected by God to be alive today, you have a purpose for this generation. You have a purpose for this time in the earth and it is vital that you wake up and you understand that. So let's finish our nugget for today because I just start preaching and I want you to hear what I wrote in here. So you would be excited to be a part of the hope the world needs. It's inside of you and it's time to release it. The hope that this world needs, the the answer to the chaos is what lives on the inside of you. If you have Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior and you are marked in your heart, you have the Holy Spirit living on the inside of you. We are the hope that this world needs. Right now, in today's generation, in the midst of the chaos, whatever's going on with our country divided, we're the answer. We're the answer because we have the hope of glory on the inside of us. And so it's time to release it. Get um, God chose you to be alive in this generation. This is something to rejoice about and not something to fear. And instead of being fearful of what's going on, rejoice and make a choice to make a stance. And, you know, it's easy for Christians to sometimes be like, oh, I'm just going to live my life and be bottled up and not say anything and not tell anybody. Well, you're missing the whole purpose. You're missing the whole purpose of why God picked you to be alive today. So our nugget from this Colossians 1.27 in the NIV, to them God has chosen to make known among the Gentiles the glorious riches of this ministry, which is Christ in you. I just wanna say that to you today, Christ in you. I think you just need to meditate on that throughout the day. Christ in me, Christ in me, what does that mean? What do I have that other people need? What does this generation need from me? It means the Christ in you. And it says the hope of glory. He's the hope of glory. And so, I just challenge you today to release what's on the inside of you. You know what God put on the inside of you? He didn't put on anybody else. It's specific for you. It's your design. It's your DNA. It's, it's what your ministry is. It's what he's called you to do. It's unique. It's special. It's amazing. All you have to do is open your mouth and release it and let it out. Maybe God is going to orchestrate somebody to be in your path today that you need to talk about that hope of glory. So take that strength that you have in Christ and release it. Have a great day, family.